Hi, it's Angie. Welcome back to my channel and welcome if you are new. Today is an exciting video. I will be doing a super motivating laundry day showing you my summer laundry routine. It is also a collab with my good friend Samantha. She is super sweet from the UK. She is married and has three adorable boys. I will put her links in the description box below. She has an amazing channel. Her content is super motivating. She does laundry, cleaning, power hours, everything, homemaking, you name it. Please check her out after my video. Okay, so in my laundry room, let's get started. I have some laundry that is in the dryer already. That is done, so I will put that in the laundry basket. I need to take down all the clothes from the drying rack. I love this thing. It is so convenient. And get all that cleared away. Then I will put the load of laundry that needs to go in the washing machine, get that started, and as the laundry is going, I like to use my time in here if it needs to be done, which today it does, I need to get the cleaning done in here. So all the dust and wiping down the machines, vacuuming the rug, everything like that, doing a little organizing. So let's get started. I would say I have a good laundry routine. Um, I like to stay on top of the laundry doing a daily load when it is possible but if not if it builds up for a few days then it's like an extreme laundry and there is so much to get done show you my little area here with everything I love to use when I do my laundry. That's my drying rack, which I love. I have my steamer here, which I need to show more love to and use more often. Um, I have the Method Fragrance Booster in Ginger Mango. At first I did not like it and now, you know, it's good. I don't use it too often, but when I do use it, I appreciate the scent. This is just some extra, um, I have it down here, some Lysol laundry sanitizer. It is very good. I love using this one because it's free and clear so it doesn't have like too much of a scent. This extra one does actually have the scent that is why it is blue. So I just have some extra here. Seventh uh, generation, I always use their free and clear laundry detergent. I have their lavender scented one back there and just a bottle of Clorox when I do need that. Up here, this is a very sturdy basket I got from Target um, from the Hearth and Hand collection. For stain removers, I love 7th generation. This one is amazing. I need to get another one almost out of that. I tried this one from Amazon. It's good, but not as good as this one. I put it to the test. Then we have um, just some samples I got like in the mail when they just send you samples of Tide. I usually don't use Tide but I do use Tide for cleaning the washing machine. I like natural with the baking soda and everything but sometimes I feel like I need something a little bit stronger so I use the Tide washing machine cleaner and then I just have some clips here for when I do decide to hang my laundry in the backyard. And then on this side I have my laundry sorter, three nice baskets, um, they're washable so those are due for a wash, maybe next week I'll get that done. And then I just have this 
uh, rod here for hanging clothes on a hanger. I just thrown it up and I don't have my hangers down here. I also want to show you this from Clorox. It is a fabric sanitizer. So in between washes, like for winter coats or anything like that, if you want to get this now, this is great to sanitize jackets and just about any fabric. But I use this mostly in the winter and in the fall when it gets a little chilly for the jackets in between washes. coming over from Samantha's channel hi and welcome I am so happy to have you here if you like this video please hit the red subscribe button and become a part of my YouTube family Let's get some folding done. Pull up your laundry basket and fold with me. If you're not doing any folding right now, I hope this brings you some laundry motivation. So let's get this done. Sometimes I have a mountain of laundry waiting to be folded, and then sometimes I get it done as I'm doing the laundry, sometimes straight out of the dryer. Sometimes I just leave it and it sits there until I'm ready for it. So let's get this done. If you are looking for more clean and motivation. I will link more of my clean and videos down below in the description box so you can go check that out. I do everything cleaning, organizing, decluttering. I love doing power hours. If you can clean on a timer and get done as much as you can on your to-do list, that that's pretty good in my book. I like to get done what I can. Sometimes I just like to take a whole day and clean. So I have a little bit of everything for you if you're looking for some more clean and motivation. Check it out in the description box below. sit down to start folding my laundry I like to get the easy stuff folded first which to me that is towels it was always the easiest thing to fold and the most satisfying getting that done and out of the way and then I just sort through see you know the shirts and um, bottoms and all that and what needs to get hung up on a hanger I put in a different section so let me know down below in the comments when you are folding, do you do it in an organized way or you just take whatever out of the basket? If you are new to my channel, remember to hit that red subscribe button. Also hit the notification bell so you know when my videos show up on YouTube. Now I'm just going to put some of my 
laundry away. This drawer in particular is a hot mess. I, no matter how many times I try to organize it, I don't know, it just keeps ending up like this. So I'm gonna try to put the laundry away in a neat way and clean around. Thank you so much for watching today's video. I hope you got tons of laundry and cleaning motivation. Please be sure to check out the description box below for Samantha's channel link and her collab video with me. I hope you enjoyed seeing my laundry routine. Please subscribe if you are new and I will see you in my next one.